Sunny in Scotland, TBTC founder. I also coach, I used to play, and also do a bit of media stuff as well. So, welcome to the channel. Hi, I'm Josh White. I'm the Bear Tiger Club Partnership Director, and also former player and coach, and just nutter, really. <laughs> Hi, I'm James. Everyone knows me as JS, co-founder of the Bear Tiger Club. I play golf the wrong way around, and I like everything. Right, our challenge on the Bear Tiger channel is the cat and mouse. So, my handicap's plus five. Used to be, I, I am a professional, it's now plus five, so I start on five over par. But whoever I'm playing against, they start from their handicap. So for instance, if somebody's off 10, they start 10 under, and it's my job to chase them down. This is a good game because you're basically just trying to work back towards zero, and it's a really good leveler. And, you know, there's always complicated games in terms of 90% and playing match play and this, that, and the other, but the cat and mouse is a really good one because what it does is it makes you start thinking about do I need to go for it or do I need to hang on to my shots? So we covered it today here at Prince's on the stunning Prince's on the shore course. Have a watch of that and give it a go. Quite a long way back, kind of miss hit the tee shot, just a touch. I've got two, two 13s, a bit down the breeze. And as it's early in the day, I'm gonna go with a soft four iron, because I'm not fully warmed up yet, so. Oh, I pulled it. Oh dear, I didn't fade. <laughs> this is warmed up. Should come around a bit, that. Half set, mate, half set. No full sets here. <laughs> Good effort, that. Wow. That is so pure. Wow. Yeah, top class, that. Very good. What do you call it? I mean, it's inside the... Snotch. 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 The snotch. That's what he calls it. I like that, guys, I don't know. Oh, settle, settle, petal. Get it out, Josh. Yes, please, mate. Yes, please, mate. It's got to move. Oh, go. Yeah, good part. Go, oh, go on. Skip it in. Good part. Okay, so hole one, out of the way, all made pars, so no drop shots. I was horribly out of position, but got away with a par. So, on to number two, par five, reachable today, down the wind. So, let's see what we got for this one. Hang on, hang on. That was a good new crater. Yeah, going on the wind. Swing, mate. Very pure. That's so hot, that. Get down. I'm comfortable with the fact that I just try and get past Josh once every three rounds, <laughs> and I'd post about it. So. <laughs> That's tough. Stay there. Yeah. Should be good, that. Yeah, love your shot, mate. Thank you. Did it break the line? Uh, it didn't, it broke the line by roll, yeah. <laughs> Rolled left. Good shot, mate. One, four, five, front. One, sixty, one, four, five. I kind of want to land it, one, four, five. Went down slightly off the right. Wedge. Ride the wind with a little wedge. More, a bit more, part up the hill an for an eagle, yeah. It's a tough left hand pin. He likes to nip them. Drived it. Oh, 
settle, settle. Yeah, nice putt. Thank you. Yo, obviously Zane's a better putter than me. Well done, mate. Par? Huh? Right. Yeah, very good. There's a bit of break there, wouldn't there? Straight in the middle, geese. <laughs> so we've got him, got one on MZ. And we, uh, so, okay. All right, so hole number two, par five. Josh and I knocked it on in two, made birdies. James was out of position on the tee, got himself back in play, made par. So, pretty steady start, actually. Pretty, quite happy with that. Just got to somehow find another one. So, I'm plus one, Josh is plus one. James is still level. And pulled it instead of fading. Turned the wrong way. Is that up? No, short. Oh, what's that hit? Oh no, sprinkler. That's hit a sprinkler, didn't it? You've got oh. that bush. Oh, like that. Fucking hell. Get out of there. Is that near the bush? Yeah, oh, I think it's just gone into the into the bit of a longer rough there. Yeah, that one. Start line. Come on. Should come in. Okay, so provisional ball. <laughs> Get out. Careful with them sprinklers on this one, mate. Trying to miss the sprinkler this time. No sprinkler, was it? Let's hit that one. Is it that? Here you go. There it is. Yeah. Good shot from there, mate. Just missed the hill, didn't it? Look. Oh, okay. Here we go. Some spring cracks are ruining your ball. It's gone, Zane. It's gone. No, I'm not over it yet. <laughs> I'm not over that. Up. Ooh, okay. Good <sighs> Turn out there. Oh, that's all right. Get away. There is all Mr. Three Wiggle, isn't there? <laughs> okay, so, a little bit of drama there. So I got on the par three, a bit of sprinkler, it's gone into the, into the Bundesliga. I was able to get out onto the green and make a par, no, make a, make a bogey, make a four. The boys hit it onto the green, but gave it a little three jab each, so no, no blood. They're gonna have to do better than that. Wind really hasn't touched it. Oh. It fade. Oh, push fade. Oh, step in there. He ain't happy. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Probably about 115 really to carry the bunker. And coming out of this stuff. Yeah, well done, mate. On the right side. Oh. Good try, mate. Oh, went right. right. Solid.
scores are Josh and I are still on plus two with our handicaps. James is even. He won over, eh? Yeah. He's won over. He's won over. So it's getting quite tight. James, what do you think of this game? I know you're not always that comfortable with playing this game. Yeah. Um, it makes you try and play more steady at golf because then obviously if you lose, it rewards the fact that people have made birdies to catch you. So yeah, just trying to clip it about and uh, play pretty conservatively. Okay, okay, nice. Yeah, change of strategy. Change of strategy, no, well, it's not what you normally go for. No, I just normally just blow it off the first hour and start moaning. Yeah, we haven't seen a little huff yet, so it's good, mate. <laughs> <laughs> a little huff. Go on then, Josh, so how's that? Yeah, game feels good, good. Long, long game feels great. I just hope the uh, putts start dropping and the putter warms up a little bit. We don't. And then uh, don't. James will feel us uh, breathing down his neck. Can you feel that? What about the golf? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Right, come on then. So we've got short, short par three. Yeah. This is quite an iconic par three at Prince's. 125 yards. Looks like the pin's up a little bit. Wind is down off the left, which is kind of awkward because it's a bit firm today. So we're getting big bounces. So, uh, so James can you can wing one of your big left to righters in there, which is becoming quite a feature of our of our channel. James's big left to righters. I've got a four wedge set, so I've got choices. So what are you hitting? I've got 50. 50. How far are you going to try and pitch it? Um, probably like 115. 115. Just let it chase out a bit. All right, cool. Nice. Let's have a look. Oh, that's nice, that. That's really nice, that. Is, it, is that too big? Come on. Long, that. Oh, no. <laughs> I mean, you've gone on as if it's like gone in the water or something. It's just gone long. Yeah, but it was it's about... It's on the green. It was just about to... Good mate. Go, go. It's on the line, it's the pace again. Oh, never in doubt. There was a tiny bit of doubt as it got to the hole <laughs> and it caught the lip. <laughs> so, no fireworks there. Short par three, we all knocked it on the green. Had reasonable birdie putts. I tried to invite some drama, but was able to tidy it up. So yeah, no blood there. Thought it was gonna be your first free putt since you were three years old. No. And even that's a rumor, isn't it? I don't remember that one. <laughs> oh, watch that, get a line on that. Yeah, shut. Head's gone. Straight into the track. Get him in the head's gone. Oh. Shut. Very good. Good job, mate. What, one, 119, now this is straight down out of right. And where the grass is, so I'm gonna get, I can see there I'm gonna get grass trapped in between the club face and the ball, which means it's gonna take the spin off it. On top of that, it's really dry grass, which means that the club will tend to go through the grass quite quickly. So it won't slow, slow the club head down when it's lush. When you hit like the lush grass, it will slow it down more, so the ball come out dead, but this being dry, and the grass is lying with me, and it's downwind, and it's length force, which is firm. This is a 120 shot, which I'm actually probably going to hit about, probably hit like a 75 yard shot, and then watch it go from there. It came out pretty soft, that. That's like a little light patch, mid flight. Grab, it's a nice looking shot as well. Made it nice. There he goes. Oh, just move. 
roll back to my feet. Done it again. How's your pace, Josh? Yeah, very good. Oh, oh no. Nice part. Thank you. Of course the score's there. Five for me. Five. So what's that? Plus one I am. Plus one. Oh well, plus two. Uh, handicap. Plus three. Plus three, yeah. Okay, so a quick round up. So James dropped a shot there. He went to plus two for the day. Josh dropped a shot also. He's now plus three and I'm a par, so I'm still plus two. So I've got tight for the lead. I'm actually a bit nervous now. Finally, we caught, this is the cat and mouse. This is the point now. So now, I haven't necessarily caught par, but I've caught James. I know that he's going to be feeling it. Go on. Oh, short all day. What happened today? Power lip. Wow. Oh, that's good, that's good. Oh, for you. <laughs> good you six. Have no, come on. <laughs> so what is this? This is number eight, isn't it? Okay, cool, go on, go outside. Okay, right, so now we're on, we're on the eighth tee, it's a par five, 542 yards. We're essentially playing against our own handicaps. I'm plus two. Plus three. Plus three. So work to do, chaps. Yeah. It is down the wind. Par five. Yeah, and there's like, there's kind of bunkers left and right, all kind of in play. There is a gap, a small gap down the middle. Are you gonna, are you gonna give it all the big one or are you gonna play safe, play three shots? Or leave yourself a long way back and go from there? I'm just gonna smash driver. Okay. Okay, James, what are you I don't think I can reach that bunker in the middle at about 390 that Josh looked at. But you feel like you can you can thread it through the, the 10 yard gap. I'm the other gonna two. just try and hit a fairway fine. He backs himself. Okay, okay, yeah. I like it. All right. Uh, I'm gonna laser the bunkers because you know I might just sit on my leader. Uh, to be honest, I think on this one in particular, I think it's just as easy. Miss the fairway with an iron or with a driver, so Yay. it's quite tight. The cheap is it. We're on, we're on. Okay. Try the track though. Oh god. Not straight. Got a nice bounce. Ninety-five straight down the wind. There's nothing short of this green. Again, it's a bit of a fly lie. So um, I probably only want to pitch this about 160. And it's going to bounce and roll. So I've got I've got nine iron. If it does if it does come out soft, it comes out short, which is not too bad a play again. 
like on most golf courses, if you do come up a little bit short, you have an easier shot because most greens go back to front. Whereas if you go over the greens, that's when you're getting a bit of bother. So Josh has played a career shot from the from the Jumanji. Onto the green. It's a bit turny. Soft bounce. Okay. Yeah, I'll be just short, but it'll be okay. Take two. Ah, knew it was going to go left to right. That one's on right all of a sudden. No, isn't it? Yeah, good roll. Well done. Go. Still a bird. Well timed bird. Still a bird. So that was a really, uh, really solid six there from the middle of the fairway from nine iron to a par five. So that's me plus three, James plus four, and Josh plus two. So all to play for on the last hole. Just get to the right side. Stay. Big green ball before the white one. Can bounce. Oh. Look at that, the excuse has come out already. Uh, what he's going to do, he's going to go a little back foot, hit down there, a bit of spin, he'll be like, yeah, I'll play spinning from divots, don't I? Just a, so it's a good life, eh, Vin? Sit, sit, sit. Bad. Just come out a little bit hot. Right, the wrist hinge should just come out a bit fast, but damage limitation. Nice that. Right, didn't it? Went right all the way. Yeah, it gets in there. Cheers, mate. Unlucky, pal. Next, next time, mate. Next time. Cheers, pal. <laughs> oh, God. Every time, last hole. Okay, so that's golf. Go from the, the disappointment of the last hole to the elation of the 18th. So, it's a good chance. So, let's have a round up. So, I finished, uh, I shot level path from nine holes, which means I was two over. Snap Josh. for me, yeah, same. What, what, what was your final score? Can you remember? Uh, plus four, yeah. Plus four, yeah. plus four, so it's not bad though. I played very much. Wind got up. Yeah, I'm struggling a bit. Golf's hard at the yeah. moment. But yeah, we'll find it. golf is really hard, but yeah. 
That was good oh, ending though. Yeah, well, Come out yeah. of nowhere and yeah. then you're yeah. yeah. It's a real it's a real shame you got in that divot. Divot good lie over yeah. there. You would have, would have smashed it. <laughs> hey listen, <laughs> I'm happy, yeah. Come from the depth of despair. <laughs>